Connie with simplysimplestamping.com back with another two minute Tuesday tip for you. I'm just gonna give you a heads up. We're gonna be running a little longer than two minutes today because I've got something very exciting to share with you. Beginning with the January 2019 Occasions Catalog, we are going to be introducing cling stamps. Now, let me explain. If you have ever struggled with getting a clear mount stamp to stick to a block, I know you have. That, that problem is gone, absolutely gone with the new clean stamps. We've got a new label that has just this really wonderful tackiness to it that I'm telling you, you can just lay the stamp on the block and it's gonna stick. You are gonna be so excited when you see these. I do have some tips on how to use them, how to take care of them, how to remove them from the block. So let's get started with our video today. All right, the first tip I have for you is how to know whether or not you have a cling mount stamp set. So you notice right here up at the top, it says that it is a cling mount stamp. You also might see a set that says photopolymer. That would be our clear stamps, all right? And then our last one is our clear mount stamps, and that's going to be the red rubber stamp. So, they are going to be treated differently. Right now, in the Occasions Catalog, we're going to be offering cling mount and photopolymer. So cling mount stamps are going to look a lot like our clear mount because the rubber is that same high quality rubber you're used to. But let's go ahead and talk about how to mount these. So I'm going to just pull it directly out of the rubber. I'm going to take my cling mount sheet here and here on the back, you're gonna see there's a little slit right here in the paper. So let's remove that. We're gonna get both sides. Now on the back of our stamp itself, there's also a paper backing. We're going to remove that. It's very important when we mount the cling mount stamps that we get it right the first time because once it's on, there's no taking it off. So I personally like to get straight up and down over my image so that I can see where I'm stamping. I also, when it comes to like a flower, I like to line that up first. So you can see I can just lay that right there. I've ke I'm keeping this lifted off. I don't want to lay it down yet. I'm kind of looking right here, making sure I get that right where I want it. When I've got that pressed down, let's give it a nice little back rub. And now to peel it away, I just pull right off. I want you to see how sticky we're talking. <laughs> wow, I mean, it is stuck, my friends, absolutely stuck. And you saw I didn't press. I didn't sit there and have to work it. It's wonderful. Now, because this is such a strong uh, type of cling, that does mean we have to remove it in a certain kind of way. You need to get underneath the stamp. That is super important. If you just go and pull this thing off, you run the risk of pulling the rubber straight off the foam. We don't want that. So make sure you get up and under and can you see how strong that is? And lift up. Now, you may find it's almost too strong. This does happen. If you find that this is just almost too sticky or you're having a hard time getting underneath it to lift it, here's what I'm gonna recommend. Bring my shirt in. Boom, 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 boom. We're just going to kind of unstickify it a little bit. It's now, still it's still super sticky, I promise. Check it out. It's not going anywhere, but just kind of picking up a little bit of fuzz from my shirt. And guys, it's not covered in fuzz, but you might be able to see it, but it does make it slightly less sticky. You might find that that works better for you. I don't recommend doing that until you've had a chance to really play with the cling. And if you do struggle, that is an option for you. But it's also really nice when you go to clean it on your chamois. You don't have to worry about that stamp falling off. Now, what to do if your cling stamp loses its sticky? Get this, you're simply going to rinse it under cool water. Just set it out to dry, it's gonna dry really quick, but it'll remove any of that and boom, that sticky is gonna be right back. So you're never gonna have to worry about those clear, uh, those clean stamps falling off of your clear blocks. Are you excited? 
<laughs> I know you are. This is going to really change the way we stamp, especially if you are a fan of using the red rubber, but you struggled with that clear mount sticker. Perhaps you just didn't even use the sticker at all. Not a problem anymore, trust me. Now, if you'd like to see any more about that, maybe check out what's in the new 2019 Occasions Catalog. Here's what you do. Head over to simplysimplestamping.com. I'll have all kinds of information waiting for you there. So if you want to get your hands on some of those new clean mounts, you can begin to uh, order those on January 3rd, 2019. I hope you'll check it out. Well, guys, that is it for me today. If you liked what you saw, I know I went longer than two minutes, but if you like what you saw, do me a favor. There's a great big red subscribe button. Do me a favor, click that button so that you can get notifications every time I'm back with another Two Minute Tuesday tip. All right, we will see you guys on the next video. Have a fabulous day. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.